Breaking Tinubu reportedly appoint Femi Gbajabia Mila as chief of staff. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for always tuning in. President Tinubu reportedly appoint Femi Gbajabia Mila as chief of staff. President Bola Tinubu has reportedly appointed the incumbent speaker of the House of Representatives. Femi Bajabia Mila has his chief of staff. According to PM News, Bajabia Mila's chief of staff, Olarin Waju Smart Wasiu, who confirmed the development, said that Bajabia Mila was appointed by the president after several hours of meeting and consultations. The decision to pick the Bajabia Milas was said to have been made by the president after evaluating a possible candidate aspiring for the post among his loyalists. According to Smart, Baja Biamila was picked by the president after a final meeting with the stakeholders that ended on Thursday morning, June 1st, at the villa in Abuja. Honorable Femi Baja Biamila, who was yet to receive his certificate of return from the Independent Electoral Commission, INEC, would have forgo his election in the House of Representatives for the sixth term. This development will also create another opportunity for other aspirants within the party that had served their ambitions to represent Sri Larry constituency first of the House of Representatives. Moving to the next news. For the third time, tribunal steps down Peter Obi petitions over poor schedules of documents. The Presidential Election Petition Court on Thursday, June 1st, was first to step down hearing in the petition filed by Peter Obi and the Labour Party against the election of President Bola Ahmed Tinubu. The petition was stepped down by the court following a poor schedule of documents being sought to be tendered to establish the allegations of malpractices during the February 25th presidential election. This is the third time the court is stepping down hearing in the case this week according to the news agency of Nigeria. At the resumed hearing on Thursday, the court led by the tribunal chairman, Justice Haruna Chumani, observed that the documents were not reportedly scheduled as it had ordered cancel to do. Some discrepancies were uncovered while rendering the documents from the 23 local government areas of Benue State. Council to Obi and the party, a maker of Bokbo South, to use documents not filed to conduct the proceeding, but the move was rejected on ground of illegality. The court subsequently stepped down hearing of the petition to 10 minutes and asked the legal team to refile the schedules of documents in line with the provisions of the pre-hearing report. The five judges then retired to their chambers to await when the legal team would put its house in order. The confusion happened in the presence of Mr. Obi, his running mate Dati Baba, Ahmed Labour Party Chairman Julius Abure, and other loyalists. In the other news, Lagos police dismissed Sergeant for collecting 98,000 naira out of the 100,000 naira in a young man's account. The Lagos State Police Command has dismissed a sergeant identified as Ekbo Shinoyere for allegedly extorted a man of 98,000 naira. The command spokesman Benjamin Hondoyin in a statement on Wednesday, May 30th, said Shinoyere collected his victim's phone, allegedly transferred the sum of 98,000 naira. 
Whom dare you say the police officer used a point of sale POL's machine to transfer the money out of 100,000 naira in the victim's bank account? According to him, police got the complaint from victim and the officer denied the crime when he was contacted. The command placed him under detention so he will not tamper with the evidence. We wrote to his bank and obtained his statement of account. He were able to trace the money where the POS operator transferred it before transferring the money to officer's account. We followed the due process to get his account. The victim was invited in the course of the investigation and he testified. The POS operator was also invited and he said the officer requested him to transfer the money from the victim's account to another one. The commissioner of the police, Lagos Command, Mr. Idowu Owohumwa, received the order of rooms procedures for the officers with force number 61654 attached to Sogunle Police Division and approved the punishment of dismissal from the police force. So thanks for joining. I'll see you on my next one. Bye-bye.